This Norfolk video is taking a while to edit. Must be time for a fitness update. There we have it. I didn't decide to take B-roll of me measuring myself because it might look a bit weird and I'm not that comfortable with you all seeing what I look like <laughs> underneath a t-shirt. So I was a little bit worried about actually weighing myself and doing all the measurements because about two weeks ago I went on holiday, a mini holiday with my good friend from uni. Yeah, I wasn't exercising then, I wasn't eating unhealthily but you know I wasn't really particularly watching what I was eating either. Uh, we went to an all-you-can-eat place up in Norfolk, in Norwich actually, called Cosmo. It was lovely and so yeah I was a little bit worried that I would have put on some weight but when I went and loaded up my little Excel chart of how I'm doing, turns out I haven't actually weighed myself or, well I've weighed myself and I've not actually recorded my weight and all my measurements in a month. So the last time I did it was the 9th of May and it turns out since then, even though I've been on holiday and I haven't worked out for like two weeks because after I came back from holiday I wasn't really in the mood for it. I guess it's been taking a while for me to get back into it. Over the last week I've been doing a little bit more, getting sort of back into lifting some of my weights, doing some of my squats, things like that, etc, etc. But yeah, since the full, no, since the 9th of May, I have apparently lost another 1.3 kilos. Apparently most people work in kilos, so let's do it in that. Or kilograms, I should say. Um, so yeah, I now apparently weigh 68.7 kilograms. You might also wonder, why do you take off all your clothes? Well, I tend to weigh myself before I get in the shower, so I tend to have no clothes on <laughs> or at least very little when I weigh myself so I wanted to you know make it as similar as possible because your clothes can weigh you know depending what you're wearing like I've got jeans on they they weigh a bit so that's why I took my clothes off if you're wondering but yeah apparently I've lost another 1.3 kilos kilograms I'm not particularly looking to lose weight really um, but uh, it's happened apparently and so since the start of the year, I've managed to lose almost five. It's about four and a half kilograms now. If you went back to my previous video, you'll see how much I did weigh. Well, I could tell you, I, on the 1st of January, I weighed 73.1 kilograms, and now 68.7, almost five. Well, I guess it's like 4.4, .4, if you want to be pedantic. Because I was a little bit worried that, you know, not working out, I would have, you know, got a bit chubbier again. Uh, turns out my neck stayed the same, my shoulders, are about the same. I've measured them a centimetre smaller, but that could be me not measuring them quite in the right place, etc. So it's within a fair margin. Um, but they might have got a bit smaller since I haven't been working out as much. So, you know, muscle growth has gone down a bit. Maybe, but I'm not too worried about that. My chest. I still actually carry a little bit of fat up here. But apparently I lost two centimetres on my chest over the last two, no, four weeks. So I don't know if that's muscle loss or fat loss, but I do still have, well, you know when you sort of tense, you can still grab a fair bit of boob. So I'm hoping it's fat loss. <laughs> but yeah, I'm down to 97 centimeters around my chest. My waist, I also went down two centimeters and I'm now down to 81 centimeters on my waist. My belly, or my belly fat down here, I've now gone down to, you know, you can still grab a bit, but it's, I hear this where men tend to keep most of there. Excess fat. There's not too much there. And I'm now down to 88 Ooh. centimeters on my belly or stomach. My hips also lost a centimeter on. 
turned down to 87 centimeters. Pretty much stayed the same on all my arms. There's about half a centimeter between all my measurements. Again, that could just be me measuring wrong um, or measuring slightly differently where it was, but it's been, they've been popping about the same, you know, measurements for a while. The same with my legs. My legs are basically the same. I don't really concentrate on my legs. I think I've got pretty good I haven't got like really skinny legs. When I was younger, we used to do a lot of walking holidays and I do walk a lot and I stand up quite a lot and you know, bending up down. So it's not like I don't use my legs. So I feel like they're quite well defined, fairly muscly already. So sort of my thighs are around about 55, 56 centimeters and my calves are about 37, 38 centimeters still. My right leg's a little bit bigger than my left. So apparently I haven't been too bad because you know, I didn't exercise for about two weeks and I had that week holiday. It doesn't seem like I'm being too bad. Obviously like being back at work now I'm still eating or I'm trying to eat healthy, you know, still having salads. I do need to up the amount of protein I think I ingest because I don't think I eat enough proteins. So you know more sort of like I guess chickens, fish, things like that, like tuna maybe because I like tuna. So I need to try and I guess have a bit more of that in my diet but apart from that it seems to I seem to be doing fairly well which is good and so I guess I shall leave it there it's quite a quick video I'll try to make it fairly quick like I say it was a bit more of an update I didn't realize it had been a month since I'd sort of jotted everything down I used to do it every week it's been it's been about a month last year this time around this time last year I was actually about 70 kilograms so you know I'm down one three on last year but yeah it was really Christmas that did me in apparently <laughs> I'm still not drinking all that much either so I think that's a real big help as well actually it's the not so bloated from my alcohol and things like that so yes I'll leave it there thank you for watching remember to like comment subscribe all those shenanigans I will be getting my Norfolk video out because it is taking a while um that's my trip with my friend up I took a lot of pictures, it's taken a while to, you know, place them all in, add pictures, a few sound effects, etc, etc, but I'm trying quite hard with it. But yeah, it's, ta it's taken its time, unfortunately, what with other things and work, blah blah blah, it's just, it is taking its time, but it should be coming, hopefully, very soon. But I thought I'd make this quick little one, and yes, like, comment, subscribe, all those funny games. I shall see you in the next video. Sparks out. The eagle-eyed of you might have noticed a slight change in the background. Yes, something interesting has changed. <laughs>